what is up ACK with another Mobile Legends video. Today's one guys is about the new hero Havang Jinny and also about the new update which is coming uh, on today on the test server but I think on let me have a quick look. Okay I think a week later or is it on Monday? We have to look I think it's on Monday on the normal server we have, will be available at okay so Hwang Jinny comes out in a week like next week on Friday will be Hwang Jinny out and also there's some like improving soul vessel skills guys and that is something new and they will increase the stats of your heroes but yeah let's go through the patch notes guys we have epic hero Hwang Jinny she's an order hero and a mage Hwang Jinny Lunar some stress from the city of dragon has come to the land of dawn will you able will you be able to hear her thoughts and the soft melodies she sings so Evangeni is a mage with team support ability who deals huge damage to multiple targets she has a unique melody system that grants herself stacks of melody when she uses her ultimate skills and basic attack when her ally uses an ultimate to deal damage to enemies Havang Jinny will use melody stack to make extra attacks dealing damage to these enemies so basically uh i don't know why but uh, she looks a bit like chang yi though and huge damage and what i like is this one where when her ally uses an ultimate so it's like the opposite of a Kashyyyk. When the enemy uses an ultimate, you will get bonus attack and stuff. But with this one, if your ally uses an ultimate, it will make extra damage. So a bit of the opposite of a Kashyyyk, not the enemy team, but your allies. When her ally uses an ultimate to heal allies, Havang Jinny will use melody stacks to provide shields for these allies. Havang Jinny's ultimate Lunar Luminescence generates melody stacks, chases enemy in a special way and knocks them airborne three times. Like, that is good. That is really good. Valor is knocking the enemies airborne like one time, also as Atlas. But Vang, I will just call her Vang, uh, will do it three times. So Vang Jinny's Joyo's Note is her main damage dealing skill. That is huge damage to multiple enemies. Her variation reduces one enemy's energy and stuns them when their energy drops too low. Her Li Jato grants her a shield when Melody stacks up, increasing her durability in battle. Okay, so what I do like about this hero is the if you are getting healed, you will get another shield. If you're putting damage, like your damage dealers, uh, you will get extra damage. So I think she could synergize maybe in a Valor team, but we will see when she will come out. And now guys, this is what I love and I will show you this too. Redesign epic hero Yi Sun Shin's portrait and appearance in battle and revamp, uh, revamp his ultimate animation and the portrait on his Orle card, Son of the Sea accordingly. So, it's he looks really cool, but it means nothing has changed about him and his skills uh, except for the animation. And yeah, <laughs> that's it. Okay. Oh, by the way, one, two, three, four, six. So there is Yi Shun Sin with uh, Yi Sun Shin. What I do like, so he looks like this. <laughs> Bro, I cannot, I don't know why I can't stop laughing. But there we go. So this is Yi, Shun's, Yi Sun Shin now. <laughs> Nothing has changed. Let's do, let's do the, it, it looks cool, guys. The animation is really great. It li really looks cool. So let's see it over here. Overall, he looks really nice now. So, he looks way more younger than before. But okay, so nothing has changed about his skills. But maybe they will do in future. Guys, I don't know why you get love. So, <laughs> okay. We, okay, let's, let's put this dude away. But he looks cool. He definitely looks cool, guys. Let's go back. Uh, watch him like this. So, he does look cool. His hat is off. And... Um, the beard also good shape, but it looks dope, I would say. Okay, so that, that's it about Yi Sun Shin. Let's go into the notice tab over here again and read more of the update. 
self balance adjustment, increase the attack boost of skin synergy pool party from 500 to 750. Okay, this is just for pool party if you have bought, I think. Let me have a quick look. I'm a bit dismantled. There we go. Oh, okay, we get some. But this is just a test account. These skins can be activated. Skin, so you need four to get 750 attack. Before it was 500 as with this heroes. But okay, so it's fine. Let's go to the next one. New features. Realm of Legends Lunar Tune is about to unfold. Wang Jinny follows the tune she plays and arrives at a strange place where she will unlock her own trials. Will be available at, uh, what is it? No, no, October the 8th. <clears throat> now there's something pretty nice. Added a body swap battle. Stage 2 Legends revived. Unlocked after clearing campaign. I don't know what the body swap battle is, but we will see it, of course. Also after 4520. So what I do not like about this update is just we need to unlock 45 and stuff. So I cannot show you this, unfortunately. But we will do a video, of course, whenever she is out. Added a lineups tab to the hero's interface so that your lineups in each mode can be viewed more easily. I'm still not on a lineup with two bosses, so I cannot show you this. Added the Enzyme Twilight system to Soul Vessels. So, Enzyme Crystals, Enzyme Glasses and Enzyme Lenses can be used to draw out the powers hidden within Soul Vessel and unlock higher hero skill levels. Enzyme Twilight unlocks after clearing campaign 3845 and materials can be obtained from Idle Rewards, Market and Guild Alchemy Shop. So, Idle Rewards, I think the chances are Maybe as getting a twilight orb, like the uh, for the equipment guys to upgrade your equipment. Market you can buy them for five hundred on level one for a single one, five a uh, thousand for the second one level two, and two thousand for the third one, which will cost us like we need ten of them each for upgrading them a bit. It is ridiculously expensive, so you need. 5,000, 15, 35,000 gems to upgrade from level one to three, but the abilities will change drastically. So you will get HP from level 30. You will have about around, let's say 16% more HP. It will go up to 22% HP. And also the level of uh, the skills, I think, will also be higher then. So overall it's pretty nice, but it is very expensive. So what is also pretty nice about this, by the way, on the Guild Alchemy shop, you need a Guild Alchemy on level 10 to get them. Added new Japanese voiceovers, available for download. Now you can go to settings, select voice to switch languages and feel our hero's charm in different languages. Let me have a quick look. Can we do this? I think we should be able to. Where is it? I think it will, yeah, it will restart now. I want to hear a bit of the voiceovers, guys. If you want the video just with all the voiceovers of every single hero, let me know down below the comments, guys. We will do that. Yo, that is crazy cool, man. I want to hear. Okay. Yo, he sounds like a badass. Let's go to Argus. Okay. What about Lumox? Okay, let's also hear about Marty's. Yo. Nice! I like it. I really do like it. I enjoy it. So, let's see. Chill, bro! Don't shout at me! So, let's see. 
We have the different languages added limited items to market and guild shop. Go and check them now. So I haven't seen anything there, but we will go there and see if there is something. Maybe I haven't seen it so far. And let's see. Added various in-game voiceover for all heroes played when they are stirred up, awakening or idling, which you can listen to on the voice interface of their info screen at any time. Fixed an issue where epic hero Freya's Wings of Faith would sometimes attack targets on the left when targeting the right. So just some optimizations, art assets, display effects on Fusion Shrine, display effects on the post-game screen in Tinted Merge, and added display support for foldable devices. So the new games are coming out, like the, what is it, Z3 from Samsung, where you can fold your mobile phone. So they're gonna display, uh, support this one too. So when they idle, they should also talk a bit. Let's get the chest. Nothing too fine in there. Can you talk? Okay, they're not talking. Maybe I have. We see idle islands. Okay, okay, that's what she, she is saying in Japanese. Not bad. Let's check out the market, guys. There is limited stuff. Where? We have those. Okay. Refresh. I don't see any limited stuff, though. Now it's 100. I don't want to spend this. Guild shop. Also nothing limited. Maybe we need to reach again chapter 45 or 38. I don't know. One of the... Uh, one of each other we will see though but yes yeah, so this is it so far for the update guys as always i hope you guys enjoyed this one feel free to like subscribe and also leave down a comment below the section see you on the next one bye bye